was another day in the clashing realm when all of a sudden, a basic bitch pops up. Sup guys, so we have landed on this insanely maxed out Town Hall 9. Now I'm joking guys, we have just, just discovered this base. Look how terrible it is. So welcome to this video guys. It is a brand new video, maybe starting a new series, destroying bases. Now nah, I'm only joking, this is just a one-off. We are going to absolutely ruin this guy's base just using a standard botch. This is without a doubt the worst Town Hall 10 I have ever seen. They had one level 2 expo. Apart from that, the entire rest of the base was just so basic, it literally was asking for an ass whooping, and we gave it that ass whooping that it needed. Open a can of whoop ass on that bitch. Yes, can of whoop ass, I did just use your name. So we're taking out the town hall, the balloon is about to poop on that, dropping the pirate ship, there it goes, two star guaranteed, 91%, 93, going for the 99er, are we going to get the 100? Yes, we are, three stars in the bag. So guys, we have decided to go hunting, looking for some of these badass bases, and we have come across this Town Hall 9. Now, it's not the worst one I've ever seen. The structure of it itself is actually terrible as well, to be honest. We're just going to destroy this with the botch game. Let's see if we can get the 3-star on this badass base. Any Town Hall 9, Town Hall 10 base that can be 3-starred with a basic botch army. Guys, just, you see that big home button on your screen, if it's an iPad, iPhone, whatever it is, just, just, Get a, get a hammer, put a nail on that, and just smash it into it. Destroy your phone, guys. You shouldn't be playing this game. Now I'm only joking. I'm only kidding with you. Keep playing, man. You're making it easy for me. Giving me some easy loot, although there's not really any loot in here. But we're just going to destroy the base anyway, just because we can. Because I and many other people are a big, fat yeah, I'm only joking. We're not really cunts. So we are going into town on this base, guys. Oh, 69%. We are on there. 71, 74. We're climbing. We're climbing up the hill. These tethers are doing so much damage to my troops. Come on, King. Please survive. I beg you, King. I beg you. King is surviving, guys. Oh, oh, shit. We lost this bitch. Man, we lost, we lost the Queen of War. She's down, guys. Is the King going to be able to recover? Town Hall's gone down there. We're on 94%. Can we get the three star? Of course we can. The King, Zeus himself, is smacking through the golden walls of Olympus. Moving on to the Elixir. The Dark Sauron gold, whatever you want to call that shit. The Archer Tower has gone down. There is one infamous level two air defense there. Ding, 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 ding. And it's down. Three stars in the bag. Ooh, so we're going on to another one, guys, and I came across this base. Now, I have never really used giant healer strategy, literally ever. So I've got a jump spell with me, some wall breakers, some of the big badass wall breakers coming along. we got 24 giants. They are only level 5. I think I'm going to upgrade them next, but I'm not sure. Either them or golems, guys. Comment down below, which troop do you want me to upgrade next? I don't know if you've uh, seen the troops, uh, troop upgrades I've got. I'll show you after this attack. But what shall I upgrade next? Hogs are currently only going to level 2 as we speak in one day, guys, or something like that. So as soon as they're done we're gonna go and do something else obviously so we're sending in a couple of the baddest giants in the realm these big ginger bastards they are moving in towards these defenses sending in another 22 of them we've got wall breakers which have gone in maybe we should have brought rage spells instead as they are a bit slow and this base is pretty big they've got all the walls built so we do need a decently sized army to actually move through it obviously if we had some wizards or something like that we could have cleaned up a lot better but the giants are moving through the royalty the sexiest couple in the realm are moving in there as well we got the queen slapping that elixir storage up the king is moving in on the expo that anti-air expo is firing down our barbarians shooting those little cunts in the face but unfortunately for him the king was just too oh shit we just lost like seven or eight giants how many did oh heal spell ah oh. Heal me, heal me, Anthony. Heal me, my precious. So we've healed those giants, guys. They're moving on to the mortar now. Gonna take down that level 8 wizard tower as well. No, guys, it is only level... What is that level 1? I think it was level 1. Those barbarians look actually insane. Look at them with their helmets running through like they run this shit. The, oh, my God, we just lost more giants. The queen is taking out some of those big boys. But look at the damage they're getting done. They're about to go down. We've lost all of the giants, guys. Every single giant is dead. 24 of those big guys wasted. The king is dead. Oh, come on. King v. Queen. Smack that bitch up. Queen is taking out some of the gold. And this doesn't look like we've actually managed a three-star here, guys. What a fail it was. The, I like the base design of this, actually. It looks pretty cool. Like a kind of like a triple-layered gem. 
So maybe, just maybe, if we find this base again, we'll bring some wizards and maybe we'll destroy it. And then again, maybe we won't. We'll probably never find the base again, especially, uh, they are level 2 wizard towers, by the way. See that little pur purple speck there? Level 2 wizard towers. So they survived us. The queen is still managing to go to work, though. We haven't used her ability yet. Can she overcome this base and get the 3 star? I highly doubt it. She's about to go down. Down she goes, down she goes, then to the river she goes, and she is dead. And then the archers are left to clean up, but I'm afraid they're just way too weak. Cannons fire their balls at them. As ever, the archers suck them up and die. So guys, as I said, these are the troop upgrades I currently have. Now, we don't really have the best troops, I'm not going to lie, but I have only had this account, as I said, literally since 1st of October or something like that. So about 6-7 months I've been playing this game, so they're not actually too bad. Lava Hounds are currently level 2. Golems, I want to get to level 4 before I go Town Hall 10. By the way, I am going to Town Hall 10 within the next month, just to let everyone know, guys. I'm going to make it a surprise because I'm going to gem that bad boy. All we have left to upgrade are one cannon. One cannon's left. We've got two Archer Towers left. Four Tezzers and two ADs. That is it. I want the King and Queen both to be level 15 at least. So as soon as we get the King up one more level, we're going to start farming some DE today. So we're getting that D in the bag, guys. Going to get that King to level 15. Then we're going to be doing the Queen. We're going to get them both up to level 15. And then hopefully we can do at least 150 of the level 9 walls. So far, we've got 80 of them done. So we're not doing too bad considering we haven't been farming the last week, week and a half since we left Champions League. Champions League did actually force me to farm a lot. Anyway, moving on from that, guys. We are going to go and find another kind of maybe shitty base but we want to find something decent with a bit of loot so we're going for the giants the healers not healers sorry maybe a couple of heal spells but we got archers and a lot of wizards this time of course we do have some of those wall breakers coming along so we've oh let's gem that four minutes so two heals one jump one rage let's see what this badass game has to offer us please lord of gold give us a million in loot i've never seen over a million, well, I've seen 1.1 million. I've never seen above that for myself. Please bring us a big loot raid. So we've landed on this Town Hall 9 and I literally can't find any loot anywhere and it's taken me like 5 or 8 minutes. I don't even know how long to find this shitty little base. So we're just going to try and wreck this base instead. Now I don't think we're going to get a 3 star to be honest. Not with the army we've got but we can always try and go for it. So we're going to attack. We want all of the loot but it's kind of like ooh, the expert. Oh 3 stars guaranteed. Come on. Let's just go in here. Giants for the rescue! Giants! Ah, ah, wall breakers! And then we're going to clean up with all the whizzes. We sent every single one of those troops in there. What are we going to do? What are we going to do? we got the archers on hold just in case we need them. Okay. Oh, shit. No, no. Whizzies. Whizzies! No, my pretties. They are dying. All right. So we got the queen. The king? The king tanking for the top. Let's use a heal spell there just because we can. We're going to use a heal and a rage there because we can as well. Where's the queen? The queen is there. The giants are smacking this base into smithereens. I don't know where all the wizards are. We got one Harry there. Harry, where's your twin? There's two more there. We got oh, two more there. Doubles. Single. He's the lioness there. Standing on his own. Standing on her own. Sitting at the back of the pack. We got the king moving in now. We got to watch the king and the queen to make sure their abilities get used in time. Jump spell is there. Look how saint that. That just looks like an angel. An angel was oh shit. An angel has fallen on our base. King's ability was just used in time. Barbarians spawn up out of the ground, ready to take down all these archer towers. Down it go. Oh, the big bad giants are moving in as well. We got the wizards still alive. This base has been absolutely cleaned up. I thought that was my queen there. But unfortunately for him, it was his queen. So our queen, our queen is cleaning up. Going through that little purple wall there. Smacking that out of the way. Giants moving in with their gold fists. We got the Barb King going around the outside. Is the queen going to be able to take out the Archer Tower before it pops her in her head? Are we going to do it? Queen V... Archer V's Archer. Archer V's Archer! We won. Standard procedure. Air defense is going down. One Tesla and one Golden Ball Cannon left to survive. Let's just use these archers. Let's throw them all in because they're so sexy and they just want to get some points to themselves. Taking out the army camp. Are these little purple bitches going to be able to shoot the Garden Cannon? Are they going to get the Golden Ball for themselves? Yes, they are. Tesla's gone down. 99er. 99er? Where is the last percentage? There it is. So the race is on, guys. Place your bets. Place your bets. Okay, I'm giving 5 to 1 on the king. I'm giving 100 to 1 on the uh, the archer. The oh, shit. The giants are lagging as well. We got the queen and the archers tinging that bitch. Tinging, pinging. And he's gone down. Three stars later. 500k loot on the table. What are you saying, bitches? We just ruined that guy's base. 
So guys, they are some extremely shocking bases that we've seen in today's episode. But before I end this video, I want to make a few small announcements. Firstly, guys, it's really annoying when people comment on the YouTube channel, on my YouTube channel, and they use link comments, guys. If you use a link comment, I cannot reply to you. So a lot of people have been doing this recently. I can't reply to you, and then you ask me why I'm not replying. It's because I can't reply to you. So if you've realized that I haven't been replying to your comments, guys, Google how to make sure that someone can reply to comments or something like that because you've got some, some sort of setting on your YouTube channel which doesn't allow people to reply to you. Literally no one can reply to you. All I can do is give you a thumbs up. So when you get the thumbs up, just give a cheeky little smile. On top of that, guys, the first link in the description box down below is the fastest way to get free gems in the world period guys. It's my personal code to uh, cash for apps. It gives you some extra points I believe. It gives me some points as well so we can get some gems, bring out some good videos, make some awesome content for you and get you to hit that like button. For anyone wondering about the PS3 guys, there is going to be that given away. I already have everyone that's entered guys so you don't need to enter or ask to enter that already. I already have everyone. It's going to be Friday coming now and the 20k sub giveaway is also going to be on Friday so for the last announcement of this video if you want to enter the 20k sub sub giveaway is going to be eight probably six or eight times $15 gift cards guys I haven't decided yet I need to buy them all these gift cards all these giveaways are real guys ask anyone that's won every single person has received their code it's literally an instant code it's going to be for iTunes Android Google Play anything like that I literally message you you tell me what you want and you get your code within a day a day to two days at the latest of winning the actual competition so in order to enter all you have to do is share this one video hit that like button down below retweet any of my true uh, any of my tweets on Twitter guys share my photos on Instagram anything like that will get you entered into the giveaway as ever thank you so much for watching and supporting this channel we are probably going to surpass 15k subscribers in a couple of hours guys so thank you for that it's been an amazing journey so far here's to 10 million subs peace out